All right, one last video before lunch break is over. Checking out the Trimble XR10 with Microsoft HoloLens 2. One thing that's super cool is the increased field of view. This is so much more immersive than the previous HoloLens 1 sort of postage stamp feeling of, of a small area in front of you where you could clearly see the four sides. Right now I can basically see a bottom edge, but the left, right, and top uh, go quite far out. Uh, the other thing is how much more bright this display is. You can see the windows are wide open here and it, although it's an overcast day with the HoloLens 1 I would have to close the blinds to get this crisp of a view. So one last thing I want to show here is go into menu, uh, navigate, and then street view Notice, tap a location on the model to enter Street View. So if I want to start at the front of the building, I'll just click to jump myself right to the front entry. And so at this point, I could actually walk through the model. Just walking through doors and you can see bits and pieces of the model show up. It's a fairly complicated model, so Parts of it are hiding to conserve resources, but while we're here, we can just navigate through the model, which is really quite cool. So here's the toilet room. I can just take a quick step in there, and there's an actual toilet. Take a step back out. So the navigation is pretty comfortable to be able to move through the building if you're not actually in the physical space. And this is actually the first time I've done this, so it's working quite well. Notice I'm even going upstairs right now. And I'm just doing the simple air tap technique of picking my index finger and thumb together. Now this room has some cabinetry in it. I'm not quite sure if it'll load with just a little bit of time. Pretty sure that countertop wasn't there when I first came into the room. I'm not sure if I can rotate the model. Yeah, right now, anytime I click, it just wants to jump me to that location. So that's not something you can really do right now. And because I was goofing around with that, it looks like it jumped me up onto the roof. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and exit out of this and call it a day.